Audi und herzlich willkommen zurück bei äh, Red Dead Redemption 2. <lacht> ähm, ja, wir haben in der letzten Folge ähm, Strauss aus dem Lager verbannt und sind jetzt auf dem Weg zu Sadie. Und dann gucken wir mal, ob wir alles so hinkriegen, wie wir uns das vorstellen. Und ich glaube, dass wir uns mit ganz großen Schritten auf Arthurs Ende vorbereiten. Ich glaube nicht, dass Arthur das noch so lange mitmacht. Ähm ich könnte natürlich da oben mit Hamish noch angeln gehen, aber da habe ich gar keinen Bock drauf. Deswegen... Da liegt ein totes Pferd. Wir machen es auf zu Sadie. <lacht> Wie gesagt. Hier in dem Bereich können wir auch wunderbar Crashfeld einreiten. Das sollte kein großes Problem darstellen. Okay, my girl. Ja, my girl. My girl. Was ist denn hier für ein Häuschen? Ja. Egal, sprach Karl. Wir haben andere Probleme. Ich habe noch nie einen von denen befreit. Könnte ich mal tun, aber... Nein? Arthur ist hier der Gute. Und wenn da jemand in den Knast soll, dann soll da halt jemand in den Knast. Das ist uns egal. Mein Gott. Hoffentlich hat die ein gutes Boot. I know he's your husband, but it's gonna be... Well, it's gonna be violent. I insist. Insist all you like. Ain't happening. Arthur, tell her. Tell her what? She ain't coming with us to collect her husband. I... Abigail, you ain't coming. That's the end of the matter. See, there you heard him. Now let's go. But... But nothing. It'll be quicker and easier with just the two of us. Plus, John will be calmer without worrying about you. Ain't complicated. Well... Well, I ain't the crying sort, but I'm real grateful. Yeah, we know you are. We'll bring him back to you. Thank you. Thank you both. Warum weiß sie eigentlich davon? Jeder davon, dass das, das, das Dutch äh, das nicht weiß. Weil er es gar nicht wollte. She hopefully give us a bit of cover to move in close enough to find a spot look for John. This time of day. Prisoners probably be working the fields. Then all we gotta do is take out all the guards and row our way out of there. Seems simple enough. Um, how many times, Mark? Mhm. So, jetzt fällt mir gerade noch was ein. Äh, was war denn das hier? Äh, Abschütze? Ja. Hatte ich nämlich festgestellt, dass ich das zwar schön wunderbar einmal angezeigt bekommen habe, aber es waren nur 79 und nicht 80. Das heißt, ich habe jetzt nochmal vielleicht die Chance, das dann zu ändern. Okay, bring us over. We good? Get 
Ja, was denn? Ich will von hier aus machen. Soll ich den da oben erledigen? Toll. Da. Lancaster's Repetiergewehr. Nehmen das Rolling Bock Gewehr. Aber nicht mit dem Lancaster. Sondern mit dem Tomahawk. Ich will nicht schießen. Ist viel besser so. Den Typen vom Pferd runterholen kann. Schauen. Komm schon. Geh. Okay. Geh. Okay. Schritt noch. Schön. So, Moment, dann kann ich jetzt die nächste Mission mir anschauen. Na, endlich. Habe ich zwar jetzt wieder alle kostet, aber hey, egal. Wir sind sechs Tiere, ohne deine Waffe zu wechseln oder nachzuladen. Ja, und jetzt raus hier. Ich muss hier nicht einholen, ich bin da schon vor hier. Da kommt sie endlich. Ich hole meine Tomahawks. Come on, Arthur. Let's keep moving. Where is he? You see him? No. You, Mister. You know John Marsden? I, he ain't. He ain't working today. Put the gun down, lady. No. You put the gun down. Now. Muss ich mich jetzt als Wachmann verkleiden? Where's John Marston? Uh, he ain't in the work detail today. Okay, well I guess we'll go and get him together. Try anything, I'll blow your damn head off. You clear on that? Yes. Very clear. Oh, no, you don't. Come on, partner. <clears throat> hey, why don't you apologize to the lady for pointing a gun at her? Excuse me? I said apologize. <laughs> I'm sorry, ma'am. Ain't no harm done. So, where do we go? Towards the entrance, I guess. And who's in charge of this fine establishment? 
Jameson, sir. Jameson who? No, Mr. Jameson. Heston Jameson. Uh, is he a nice fella? Uh, he's been quite an exacting boss at times. I look forward to meeting him. They're... they're not gonna let you do this. Well, that's gonna be up to you, my friend. <laughs> Nicht schneller und ich habe ihn kaum unter Kontrolle. Please. So, you a popular employee, my friend? Not especially. Well, I guess we're about to find out. Mhm. Mm Come on, march him straight up to the front gate. You better hope someone in there actually gives a damn about this fool. Guess we'll see. We're gonna have to shoot our way out of here regardless. Die macht mir schon so ein bisschen Angst. Und der nächsten, den sie so haut. Okay, Fran, be cool now. Just do as I say. Drop the goddamn guns! Jameson! Is Jameson in? He's insulting me. They got Milliken. Got him and gonna kill him. Unless you bring me John Marston. Right now. You got one minute. I'm counting. One, two, three. Uh, uh, Milliken, uh, is it? Yes, sir. Will you count for me? I got talking to do. Uh, yes, sir. Of course, sir. <clears throat> From one or four? Oh, so? very funny. No, we must be at 11 by now. 11, 12, 13, faster. 14, 15, 16, 17. Now hurry up! Well, this poor fool's gonna get his brain shot out. And over what? For nothing. Hey, Milliken, don't stop counting. I can't hear you. <laughs> hurry up and break that asshole out here, you bastard. Come on! Don't cry, buddy. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. Hey, hey, John. Hello, you too. Now, no funny business. Well, Mr. Mannequin here will stop crying once and for all. Okay, today's your lucky day. Let's go. <laughs>
füllen wir erstmal die Wache. Ist gut. So, ich muss offensichtlich dann mal. Äh, das ist gut. Ein Schluck Alkohol. Das nehmen wir. Na ja, toll, jetzt muss ich sterben, weil die da nicht aus dem scheiß Tor rausgekommen sind oder was? Wollen die mich denn vergackern hier? Der kann ja wohl nicht der Richtige sein hier so. Weil davon gesehen, dass der Plan ja ohnehin schon losgegangen ist. Eins. Zwei. Drei. Das war nicht der Plan. Das war nicht der Plan. Geh da rein. Lauf da raus. Da raus. Viele. Oh, 
Okay, und stopp. Alter, die schießen aber ganz schön gut, dass sie so weit weg sind. Coming here don't look too friendly. We best get out of here. Come on, boys, let's move. I'll row. You shoot. Seriously? Let me. You, you're a better shot. All right, fine. You just relax and enjoy yourself, John. Leave the real work to them as can still handle it. Thanks. Muss fast leer. Wollen wir das dann mal wieder ändern? Na. You know, I think I liked you better when you was all trussed up like a prize chicken. No doubt. Oh, hurry up! They're gonna be on our tail soon enough if you boys keep wasting time. Oh, that's us told them. Uh, hey, Arthur. Thank you. Don't mention it. Let's go. We should get out of here quick before the law gets wind of this. Yeah, done. So what the hell happened in San Denis? Is Abigail all right? She's fine. Jack is too. She managed to escape when they got Hosea. Hosea? That still don't seem real somehow. All them years, Arthur, he was like, like family. Yeah, we lost young Lenny too. No. What a goddamn mess. And did we... What about the, the money? Lost oh, somewhere at the bottom of the ocean. What? How the hell did that happen? We hit on a boat. It was the only way out of there. The boat went down in a storm, and we ended up stranded on an island somewhere near Cuba. Cuba? Wait. You're gonna have to tell me all this again. It's a long story, but things ain't been... Good, John. <laughs> You're telling me. We're holed up now in the mountains to the north, near Roanoke Ridge, and some caves there. The Pinkertons caught up with us again, and we had to move. Yeah. Seems Molly ratted us out, the bitch. So she's dead too. Jesus. Maybe you should have just left me to hang. And uh, I should warn you, Dutch didn't want us breaking you out. Said it wasn't the right time, so... Might not be the hero's welcome you're imagining. So much for no man left behind. I can't stop thinking about this. In the bank, when they grabbed me, he saw it. Felt almost like he had a, a moment to do something and didn't. Dutch ain't himself right now. Or maybe he just ain't who we thought he was. Guess we don't need to worry about who's his favorite no more. Huh. Guess not. Ich fürchte, Dutch hört zu sehr auf Maika. Und ich trau Maika nicht. Ich bin immer noch der Meinung, Maika war es. Der Penner hat mit Sicherheit irgendeinen Deal laufen. Straffreiheit oder sonst irgendwas, was er ansonsten sofort hängen würde, sobald sie ihn erwischen. Irgendwann mal. You brought him back to me. We told you we would. John! What are you doing here? It's good to see you too, partner. I meant I hadn't sent for you yet. I went. But I said that. Yeah, I know what you said. I felt different. 
Is that so? Yes. And when Spring and John brings the law down on all of us, what then, Arthur? Well, I guess we'll have another fight on our hands. Loyalty, Arthur, it ain't. I had a goddamn plan! How is this? John. John. You are my brother. You are my son. I was coming for you. They... They was talking of hanging me, Dutch. They was talking. They was talking. And now they may come and hang us all. Der falsche Hut. Warum Zeile? Arthur. Arthur. Oh, sorry. I was miles away, thinking of, uh, <laughs> I don't know. Dutch said to tell you he and Mike have gone to Annisburg. Something about Mr. Cornwall. Cornwall. Okay. Thanks, Mary Beth. Mit Cornwall hat doch alles angefangen. Was sagt die Zeit? Ah komm, ziehen wir in der Folge noch eine zweite Mission mit rein. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, he ain't done yet, Abigail. Dutch seems. To have lost his mind? I know. Just be careful. I don't have to be careful. I have you as a friend. Ja, aber ich bin nicht ewig da. Und dabei fällt mir auf, dass ich jetzt den gleichen Bart habe wie Maika. Finde ich schon nicht gut. Aber naja. Komm schon, lass mich hier raus. Dann lass mich einmal den Hut anpassen. Zack. Und einmal... Oh. Gesucht, tot oder lebendig. Ein Kopfgeld. Wir werden einfach nur gesucht. Das ist nicht gut. So, komm, diesmal schaffen wir es hier durch den Wald zu reiten. Ohne. Vorne. Ähm, vorne. Zug zu reiten. Tülü. Yep. Ja, Melsa. Kriegt ihr erstmal eine Million. You're a brave girl. Ja, machen wir Brave Girl. Das Beste. Zack. Und wir fressen auch mal eine Dose. Geht nicht bei uns. Wolf und Bellen. So, ihr runter auf den Weg. Wow. Da lang soll ich? Okay. Ach, hier fehlt ein... Kann man Weg runter, ja? Sehr gut. Like move it, move it. Zack. Und abwärts. Gucken wir mal, was die beiden hier vorhaben. Ich glaube nicht, dass das äh, was Gutes ist. Bisher hat Maika noch gar nichts Gutes gebracht. Ganz im Gegenteil. Was you followed? 
no. Was you followed? I said no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what is your problem? What is your problem, partner? You don't, uh, you don't look so good. What is wrong with you? Nothing wrong with me. I'm fit as a fiddle. Yeah, and not inside you ain't. I'm just a realist, friend. Michael reckons there's a rat. Oh, does he? On what evidence? He's only back a minute. Pinkerton show up. <laughs> We've been on the run since you two fools went crazy in Blackwater. We barely escaped with our lives in San Denis. Now we got a rat. Well, Molly clearly talked, but who else? Maybe we pushed things too hard. Whoa. Maybe time for folks like us has passed. <laughs> we don't need a rat. We got sloppier than the town drunk, and they know who we are, and where we are, and what we're doing. The way I see it, best thing we can do is let the week go. Move on, get our money, and start over. That ain't happening. Well, something's gotta happen, and fast. Otherwise, Cornwall, them Pinkertons, they got us banned in here, and ain't none of them stopping. Well, Cornwall's why we're here. Shall we, Dutch? Yeah, it's time to go. Let's head to the river. Oh, leave Cornwall alone. He ain't. We need money. But revenge? Now? Of course it's for money. Come on, Arthur. This better not be no stupid revenge mission, Dutch. It ain't worth it. Don't be ridiculous. Oh, Arthur, it's just a simple social call. <laughs> ich hasse Maika. Das gerade war sowas von Grima Schlangenzunge. Das vertraue ich ihm noch weniger. He has been hunting us since Valentine. He is the reason that Hosea got killed. His sugar business is destroying the people of Guarma. This town, Arthur, is his town. He bought it just to destroy these folks. His sugar, his oil, his law. These are wrongs that you can't right, Dutch. We're wanted men. Hmm. So why did you go for John against my wishes? I didn't want him hanged. Neither did I. We're gonna cut a deal, Arthur. What are you talking about? We want out, and Cornwall wants us to stop robbing him, and we all know his money is what's keeping the Pinkertons on our tail. He's America, Arthur, and I want out, and he... He won't let us go. This ain't making a lot of sense, Dutch. It will, son. It will. A deal, some noise, and then we're gone. Und der Fluss wird brennen. Ich fühle mich jetzt einfach so an, weil ich das Öl im Wasser gesehen habe. Thank you for your hospitality, Mr. Cornwall. This was a business meeting, Mr. Milton. We are not friends. I have spent a considerable fortune with your agency, and still nothing. This Vanderlyn robs me and laughs at me. I asked for the best. I paid for the best. We are very close, Mr. Cornwall. I know you've heard this before. Can't, sir. Send a telegram to Goldberg in New York. Tell him I won't borrow it more than 3.2%. Sorry, no, I have heard it before. And get that army man to pay his portage charge. Yes, sir. We are doing all we can within the confines of the law. The law? I think we both know what you can do with your law. Find me Dutch Vanderlyn. Bring him here and leave the laws to them as need them. Good day, sir. Come along, Mr. Ross. We have work to do. Mr. Didsbury. Mr. Cornwall. Now listen up, Didsbury. What's all this about strikes? I bought into this mine because of mismanagement. And I intend to make it a success, no matter what the cost. It's the wages. Folk feel Folk that you... feel? Business doesn't give two figs about feelings, sir. Not two figs. And it's a nonsense that will bring a plague on both our houses, sir. Perhaps there is a plague on your house already, Mr. Cornwall. 
What do you want, sir? I'm not quite sure just yet. Your impudence will be your undoing, sir. I'm undone already. Even my best friend here, he thinks I'm crazy. And like this poor fellow you are talking to, my feelings are hurt. You robbed me, sir. And you robbed him. Funny world. You show a criminal's grasp of sophistry, sir. I did no such thing. You kill. I kill. You rob. I rob. Only difference I can see is I choose whom I kill and rob, and you destroy everything in your path. I've heard just about enough. I'll tell you what. You give me this ship, $10,000, and safe passage out of here, I'll let you live. <laughs> I'll do no such thing! <laughs> you sure? Good. I prefer it this way. You lost your man! Noise, Arthur! Noise! My lord! Nicht weit weg. Alter, du hast gerade Cornwall getötet. Ich kann noch nicht mehr so rennen, Mann. Stay with me, Arthur. Cornwall's men are all over the place. Follow me and stay close. We had enough feet on us before. Now we're gonna be going, Stretch. This is the only way you'll see. Ah, trust you. You sure you got the lungs for this, Morgan? Shut the hell up. Here come more. Take them down. Ich habe echt nur Pistole mitgenommen. Da muss ich hier das Gewehr umspringen. Okay. Son. Come on! <laughs> Alright, 
Let's head for the hills, boys. They're trying to block us off. Go right. Dick of Kutchen fährt hier. Was ist denn John zu befreien? Er hätte uns die Pinkerzen auf den Pinkertins auf den Hals. Aber Leviticus Korn war zu tun und bezahlt, ne? Das macht's besser. Wenn wir John nicht vorher befreit, wäre er spätestens jetzt wahrscheinlich tot. Social call. No, oh, don't play dumb and superior at the same time, Morgan. We all knew sooner or later Cornwall had to go. Let me see them papers. It's more attention we don't need. Feels like the whole world's closing in on us. Dutch, it won't be long before they find where we're hiding out now. Especially as we ain't exactly hiding out. We just need a distraction. Buy us some time. It looks like Mr. Cornwall's company has signed a railroad contract with the army. And they're also moving dynamite down from, well, the Annisburg mines to San Denis to resell. And there's bonds at his oil factory. Maybe there's a way to get them off our back and get the money that we need. Micah. You look into this dynamite. Take Bill, I guess. Arthur, you go too. We are gonna need a lot of it. And Mike, we need to talk. Figure out some things. Of course, boss. Figure out what? The plan. Getting out of here. Hey, Mike. Huh? It hasn't, huh? There's an old house west of Van Horn. Meet me there when you can, Black Lung. Let's split up. We'll meet up back at camp. Yeah. Und das ist Bullshit. Bullshit non plus. So, wir haben Maika und wir haben Swanson. Ich möchte schon wieder mit euch sprechen. Na okay. Und der mit mir reden will. Ein Gespräch. Schade noch nicht. Das machen wir noch in dieser Runde. Die Aufnahme Session. Und dann gucken wir mal, wie wir da weiterkommen. Das ist auch gar nicht mehr weit hier. Da vorne ist schon unser Lager. Ich habe erst einmal auch noch mal Munition äh, nehmen muss. Oh, ist aber nicht mehr viel da. Ich kann ja weiter Munition tragen. Also ich muss mir viel Polizei Pistolen Munition mal kaufen. So, Reverend. Reverend? You okay, Mr. Morgan? Nein. I don't know, Reverend. These are challenging times. For all of us. Yes, very challenging. You don't seem yourself, somehow. I, I've always felt... I've left the morphine, sir. Arthur, I'm in Reverend Swanson, would you excuse us a minute? Of course. New York, 
We are gonna go to New York. Now, they have been chasing us south and east and west. We're gonna get a boat, we're gonna get on a river, and we're gonna go north. New York. Then Tahiti, the Fiji Islands, or this place, New Guinea, dancing girls, freedom. But first, we have to make a whole lot of smoke, a whole lot of commotion. And then we disappear. We need more commotion? One score and one whole hell of a lot of noise. We ain't so good at doing scores anymore, Dutch. Are you feeling all right, Arthur? Sure, fine. Pardon me for interrupting. I brought a friend, Arthur. Hello. Hello. Dutch. This is Eagle Flash. His father is a great chief. Charles and I, we... Uh, pretended to be mercenaries. Did me a great favor. Dutch Vanderlyn. How do you do? Not well, sir. Well, I am sorry to hear that. How's your father? Father has confused wisdom with weakness. His people, my people, we've suffered too much, been lied to too much. Now they've taken our horses. Who? The infantry division posted at Fort Wallace. Why? Colonel Favors is a liar and a murderer. His people won't stop until we're all dead. Without horses, we cannot hunt. Without hunting, we will starve. This is another act of war. I see that. You men have helped me before, and I have money. Put your money away, son. What do you think, Charles? You know I told your father I will not fight over some horses. But I made no such promise. Come along. Yeah, Arthur, we must go with them to try to stop things from getting out of hand. I guess. Come along. Aber erst in der nächsten Folge, dann bin ich mal gespannt. Get the more horses. I know. Was äh, da so passiert. I understand Eagle Flies is angry, but I don't see how this will help anything. Especially not with Dutch whipping him up into a frenzy. We got enough folks coming after us without adding an army to the list. Yep. Uh, und das wird auch noch uh, ganz schön biestig werden, vermute ich. Gut. Uh, ich kann mir schon vorstellen, dass Dutch eben plant, die Indianer auf seine Seite zu ziehen. Oh Gott, hier ist auch echt nicht gut. Ähm ja, schauen wir uns einfach mal in der nächsten Folge an, was da jetzt rauskommt. Ich bedanke mich für eure Aufmerksamkeit und bis dahin, euer Staffel.